Warning, after seeing what I'm about to demonstrate here, you might never be able to see WordPress in the same way again. Seriously, I might ruin a certain aspect of WordPress for you here. You've been warned. Do you love WordPress? Because I do. Well, most of it anyway. WordPress is the only thing I use to build all of my websites and I work with it every single day. And I think it's brilliant. Well, except for one thing, the editor. WordPress was originally built for So maybe you're wondering, wait a minute, what's wrong with the editor? And I think the problem is that it's really made for creating very simple linear content. If all you do is you write some text, you have your paragraphs, you add some subheadings, you maybe even throw some images in there, that's fine. That's what the editor works for. But as soon as you want to build something more than just a simple linear piece of content like that, it becomes problematic. Here's an example. Let's say you want to add this simple layout to your content. It's very simple, right? Just three boxes with some text and buttons inside. Well, the way to do this in the regular editor is by using short codes. In this case, we'd have a short code for the columns, one for the boxes and one for the buttons. And here's what that looks like in the WordPress editor. I kid you not, this is what this layout looks like built with the short codes built into one of the themes I've been using. Quick, if I want to move some text from the third box into the second one, where do I change that? Or let's say I want to change the color of the first button in the first box. Where do I make the edit? It's ridiculous, isn't it? This is supposed to be a what you see is what you get editor, but when you're working with short codes like that, it quickly becomes more confusing to try and decipher what's going on than if you were just looking at the HTML source itself. Of course, many developers have taken note of this issue and we've seen alternatives to the WordPress editor pop up everywhere lately. Some of them are available as standalone plugins. Some of them come baked right into themes. It seems that these days everybody has some alternative, some drag and drop visual mm. editor type alternative that replaces the WordPress editor. And you know what I'm like, right? I tried to hunt every single one of them down and I tested and used every single one I could get my hands on. And I was, I mean, I did this for myself. I was frantically looking for a better alternative to this WordPress editor for myself. And what I found was that while some of these alternatives are kind of decent, most of them are honestly rubbish and don't do anything to improve the problem. After spending hours and hours testing all of these solutions, I realized that it all boils down to two factors. Some editors represent the page in building blocks that are easy to drag and drop around. This gives you some visual representation, but it's still very abstract. The thing in the editor still doesn't look anything like the actual front page. Most editors have an annoying multi-step process for adding even the simplest elements to a page. You have to drag elements into the editor, then it opens a light box where you add some settings, then maybe there's another step where you actually add your content, and then finally you can save and actually go back into the editor. And you know the worst part? This is something you really start noticing when you do some serious editing with these tools. It's what I call the endless tab switching. That's when you're working in your editor, you make a change and then you click update, you wait for that to save, then you switch to the tab where you're looking at the actual page to see, and you refresh that page to see what the change you just made actually looks like on the page. Then you see, ah, oh, it's still not quite right. So you switch back to the other tab, you go and make a tweak in your editor, you click update, you wait for that to load, you switch the tab, you refresh the page, you look at the change, you switch back and forth and so on. And this gets old really quickly when you're doing a lot of this. And in most of the editors and practically all of the editors I was using, I was doing this all the time because I want to get it right on the page. But enough of all these frustrations and about all the things that are wrong with all of these editors. After a while, I was just asking myself, okay, in an ideal world, what would the perfect page builder and page editor look like? I mean, ask yourself, if you knew nothing about how this is usually done, and if there were no technical constraints, how would you want to build and edit your pages? I think it would be something like this. You'd look at your content, and when you see something you want to change, you simply click and you start writing. You'd drag and drop elements just as you see them. Not a single layer of abstraction between you and the content you're creating. No delays, no tab switching, no page refreshing, none of that stuff. That would be perfect, right? And that's why that's exactly what we built. Welcome to Thrive Content Builder. The first truly, truly And I warned you about this. This thing will ruin every other editor you've ever used for you forever. Once you use this, you will never want to go back.
And it's really as simple as that. Once you have the plugin installed, you can simply go to your poster page view and click on this edit using Thrive Content Builder button. This takes you to the front end view of that poster page. And here you can very simply start adding content with simple drag and drop and just writing. I'm just gonna quickly add some demo content here. And when you're looking at the text, you have all the editing options that you're used to. So I can select some text, make it bold or underlined. I can create headings. So if I add a paragraph here, I can select this and turn it into a heading just like you're used to. Let's make it heading two. And you can very easily drag and drop elements around. So I simply click and drag to move that heading. Plus you can create responsive columns. So if I drop in two columns here, I can drag and drop text into a column and everything is just that easy to use and everything is right on the front end. And the most important thing here is that what you're looking at here, the fonts, the style of the website, everything you're looking at is exactly as it is on your website. And it's exactly as it is when a visitor comes to your website and looks at the front end. So there's no mental translation you have to do between what am I editing and what does the content actually look like? How cool is that? Seriously, do you see why I'm so excited about this? And you know what, that's not even all. With the Thrive Content Builder plugin, you don't only get the most amazing editor you've ever used, you also get a collection of design elements that you can use on your pages and for your layouts to really take your page designs to the next level. When you're building advanced content pages and especially marketing pages, there are some elements that always come in handy. For example, nice text boxes to highlight parts of your content, testimonials, guarantee forms, columns, and so on. Now, there are already tons of options out there that let you add such elements to WordPress pages, and usually it's done with short codes. And you already know how I feel about those. But even apart from that, the problem is that the design is usually horrible. They're usually tacky and scammy looking. You know the kind of thing where you have big red headlines and yellow highlights and whatnot. There's a certain design that just makes your page look untrustworthy immediately. And most of the sales page short code type things that I found have been this type of design. For Thrive Content Builder, we've created design elements that are the exact opposite of that. We've got two sets of styles for each element. A flat design style for a sharp and vibrant look and a classy, luxurious style with subtle but beautiful gradients. And we'll add more styles like these in the future. In this simple editor bar, Thrive Content Builder gives you everything you need to create amazing professional looking content and it makes it easier than ever before. Whether you want to create a sales page or a full-blown marketing site, or whether you just want to improve and enhance your usual content editing, Thrive Content Builder was made for you. Remember that three boxes layout we looked at earlier? Here's how easy it is to build with Thrive Content Builder. So the first thing we need on this blank page here is we need some columns. So I'll get the three columns we need here, drop them onto the canvas, and then we need a content box. So I'll choose one of the content box styles. Let's go with style number five place it inside our first column here. Now we will change the color. I simply click on it and choose gray to match the example we looked at before. And now we also need a button inside this box. So I'll get the button here, drag and drop a button inside here. Now this button is far too big, so I select it. And first of all, it's also the same color. So let's change the color and let's make it small. And I'll also make it span the full width of this box here. And then I can also select different button styles. So let's go, I don't know, with style number two. That's our first box with a button inside. And now I'll simply duplicate. I'll click this little icon here to duplicate this whole thing, drag and drop the new box into the second column. Do the same thing again, duplicate, drag and drop. And there you go. That's our three box layout already done. And the cool thing is here, if I want to change something like the button color in the second box, I don't have to go through a ton of short codes. I just click on this button and change the color. Pretty cool, right? And it's just as easy to build any kind of layout and any kind of content you can think of. Plus, this is a huge time saver. You won't believe how quickly you can build even complex layouts and things like big sales pages using Thrive Content Builder. It's really unlike anything you've ever used before. Now, what you need to know is that right now there's a special offer running for Thrive Content Builder. For only a very limited time, only for a few days, we are offering Thrive Content Builder at a lower than usual price. So the prices you see right now on this page below this video are lowered and this will only stay this way for a very short time. So if you want to completely change the way you think about content and turn 
content creation in WordPress into an absolute joy, check out the details below this page and get in on this special offer.